Hi, I'm John J. Hall, senior brewer here at Goose Island Beer Company, here to introduce our brand new beer in our Fulton Wood series. This is Grand Guaz, Scandinavian inspired beer with spruce tips and lingonberries. My name is Zach Greenwood, and I am brewing with John J. We came up with this recipe when John first tried lingonberries. And I had just been in Ireland and I had tasted a lingonberries for the first time, which are a Scandinavian tart berry that grows in small shrubs. I've never used spruce tips or lingonberries before in a beer, so I had to really rely on the staff here at Goose Island. It was nice to have a lab personnel on the job because he came up with the desktop fermentations and helped us determine how much spruce tips to add, as well as how much spruce uh, would impart on the bitterness. Another person in our lab, Dennis, spent a lot of time and created his own project to figure out how to guesstimate how much bitterness or how much spice the spruce would give us. And we added varying amounts of lingonberries. We tasted it and we determined what we liked based on taste and what we liked based on like the color. We're trying to get a ruby color from the beer. Our spruce tips were collected by Randy Snows and his wife, uh, who run a small company called Spruce on Tap. We had to wait for the spruce tips to grow or actually candle the new uh, shoots for the spring. And they had to wait to get into the, the mountains once the, the spring thaw was done. So it took a little while longer to get the tips we were looking for. But hand-picked, collected, vacuum sealed, put on ice and shipped to us directly. And within a day of getting them here in the brewery, we started brewing the beer. So we actually added the spruce tips to the Whirlpool in little mesh bags, and we let it rest with the wort for 30 minutes. After the beer ferments for 14 days, near the end of fermentation, we rack the beer on top of the fresh lingonberries and let it age until it achieves this beautiful red color. That'll be about three to five days before it's ready. So like I said, we're expecting a ruby hue and a nice flavor from the lingonberries. We don't want to overpower the beer with the fruit. Uh, we do want to get some spruce flavor coming through as well. So that's the goal with the beer. Uh, we're excited to introduce it as the fourth beer of the Fulton and Wood series. Grand Guaz is the Scandinavian or Swedish for spruce goose. This will be released on July 26th, so look for it at the local watering hole. Like the, the flavor profile? Nope, that's not in this contract. <laughs> <laughs>